We come here for similar reasons. We share concerns. We're asking the same kinds of questions. What is the fundamental nature of reality? What is humankind's role in the cosmos? And this is why I will always remain stubbornly optimistic that through discussion and reason and rationality, we can actually make progress towards at least understanding, if not agreement. Having said that, Religion and science have gone their separate ways over the years. 500 years ago, this debate would not have been held. There was no demarcation between what we would now call science and what we would call religion. There was just attempts to understand the world. And what happened is that science came about by developing techniques, methodologies for gaining reliable knowledge about the world. And the reliable knowledge that we got was incompatible with some of the presuppositions of religious belief. The basic the thing that we learned by doing science for 400 years is something called naturalism. The idea that there is only one reality, that there are not separate planes of the natural and the supernatural, that there is only one material existence and we are part of the universe, we do not stand outside of it in any way. And the way that science got there is through basically realizing that human beings are not that smart. You're not perfectly logical. We as human beings are subject to all sorts of biases and cognitive shortcomings. We tend to be wishful thinkers and to see patterns where they're not there and so forth. And in response to this, science developed techniques for giving ourselves reality checks, for not letting us believe things that the evidence does not stand up to. One technique is simply skepticism, which you may have heard of. Scientists are taught that we should be our own theory's harshest critics. Scientists spend all their time trying to disprove their favorite ideas. This is a remarkable way of doing things that is a little bit counterintuitive, but helps us resist the lure of wishful thinking. The other technique is empiricism. We realize that we are not smart enough to get true knowledge about the world just by thinking about it. We have to go out there and look at the world. 